Oh my god, it's been a long time since I wore this bow. Hey girlfriend, what is up? I hope you guys are having a nice day. I am reaching my 30s. Oh my god, I am f***ing old. Now moving forward to the age of sagging boobs and wrinkles. Girls, the main reason why I'm doing this is because I woke up one day and I look at the mirror and I was like, what the hell is wrong with my eyes? I work long hours in front of the computer, like long hours, like long hours. And I always like to laugh and I always like to do this and like, you know, do a lot of like eye expression, like, you know, my eyes are my emotions and I don't have enough sleep. Hence, I always have really, really bad eye bags and Ew, like, <laughs> no wonder I'm single. <laughs> because I am getting old, I am not getting any younger, <laughs> my boobs are not getting any more firmer, my face is not getting any more elastic, so I just... So I'm slowly sinking to this realization that I am not young anymore, I can't be wasting my time just not doing things to like prevent myself from aging, you know? So today, we're gonna be hopefully changing our age back, going back to 21, hopefully, um, with this 10-step Korean skincare routine. So I've been reading about this online, it's not a new thing, it's just that I've been lazy and just suddenly 10 years of my life just passed by so far. And yeah, these are some of the products that I bought, not sponsored by her more all these products this whole box was like close to 1k ringgit and I bought it all with my own hard-earned money <laughs> Being a girl is not cheap. All of these products are all holy grails from people who've reviewed them online. I've been doing a lot of research. So, first things first. Some of the things here I've never tried before and I'm super excited to try it for the first time. Trying it right here on Sunday Sin's channel on YouTube. 10 step Korean routine. It sounds really tedious. Like, ain't nobody got time for that, yo. 10 steps. At least try this every day for two weeks. They say if you try something for 14 days, it'll become a habit. Just to prove that if I can do it, you guys can do it too. Step one is to use oil-based makeup remover. And my holy grail, seriously, is this product. It is the Vanilla Co Clean It Zero. Super nice, super fresh. It looks like a balm. So these products come with its own spatula. So you take some out, you just dig some very little oil. It's just too much, you don't need to waste, you know, expensive product, you know. <laughs> Guys, you gotta like my video because I brought all my skincare stuff here. It's funny if you see how my setup is right now. I brought everything from a toilet here. I usually do this in the bathroom when I'm showering so I don't like waste water, right? So you just wet your hands a bit, put the balm there put some more water so it just dissolves into like this kind of milky kind of and um, just massage on your face sometimes I have like really waterproof kind of eyelashes or like eye mascara as you guys can see I think right now you can see like the makeup is dissolving off all the makeup <laughs> the remover is dissolving all the makeup and I think most of you guys are girls and I think you guys see me without makeup before and if you're a guy who wants to date me or is looking to like date me please like switch off this video because <laughs> oh my god so you see it just removes all your mascaras and all your eyeliner is all gone oh my god it looks so ew. so right now i'm gonna wash off all this dirt and gunk my god i am back guys the weather is going to rain because i think i just removed my makeup the weather is like ew hell no you're not gonna film anymore and this is how i look like naturally and <laughs> you can see like all this uh what do i call this pigmentation scars or something I don't know, I'm not really good at all this skincare stuff to be honest. And now step two, we are going to use the water-based cleanser. What do I mean by that? It is your normal face wash. So if you watch my Taipei haul, you will know that I got this from Taipei. It is the Beauty Whip Soap from Kanebo and it's super purity. It's actually a rose when you press it. I'm going to show you right now. Oh my god, it's actually a foam rose no one can buy you roses you buy yourself roses every morning the texture is like that it's super lightweight rub it around i am so sorry the lighting is like totally 180 degrees change because 
because I removed my makeup. <laughs> okay, now my skin feels super clean. It's super squeaky clean. It has that tight kind of feeling, but not too dry, which I love. So after that comes number three, which is to exfoliate. Exfoliation is really important, especially when you get those like little dull stuff in your pores. For me, when you see like really close up, then you can see it. My pores aren't that big. Thankfully, this is what I currently use all the time. Like I've been trying to get this to finish so I can use like other new ones. Now again, I'm gonna remove this with hot water. So now, right now, today, I'm trying out this new toner from Claire's. This is the brand that I heard so much people, Korean people, be raving about. This toner specifically has been the holy grail for many, many Asians and YouTubers out there. So that's why today, we're going to be testing it out. Oh my god, I never opened it before. It has that Aesop kind of look, okay? No money to buy Aesop, that's why we're buying this toner instead. It smells like Aesop law. <laughs> so this is the Claire Supple Preparation Facial Toner Moisturizing Skin Program Yada 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 Balance pH level Cleanses and soothes Deep moisturizing It's not that watery It looks like there's a bit of like oil in it But I'm not sure Wow I like it already It smells exactly like Aesop So what I like to do with my toners Is just pat it on my face Pat everything everywhere. Put in all those water. Ah, my face feels so nice. I am so glad I bought that toner. I am so happy. So Essence is to renew and nourish your skin. The number one skincare treatment out there right now is SK2 Pitera treatment. And everyone rave about this. But one bottle costs like damn expensive. And us girls, we are broke. So we find something similar to the Pitera treatment. So I've been using this bottle ever since I got back from Taiwan. It is been rave everywhere. They say that this is the substitute for SK2's uh, Pitera treatment, which is so expensive. Just to prove that I'm not lying, I already stock up on another one. I have like still half a bottle left, but here's my new one that I stock up on. And I feel like it really locks in the moisture and it's just so good. So I'm just going to demonstrate right now how it looks like. So that's how much I, I use sometimes. Let's see. It's very watery. It's just like water. So you just pat it over your skin and it just feels so good. And again, I bought something from Claire's. This one is the holy grail. The holy, holy, holy grail of a lot of people. Like even the packaging is like... Wow! They are vitamin C drops and vitamin C is good for your skin. After a lot of research, they say that you shouldn't put your vitamin C outside where the sun is. It will change the effectivity of your essence. So store it in the fridge or store it back in the box. Okay, this is the Claire's Freshly Juiced Vitamin Drop. Pure Vitamin C and Centella Aesthetica Extracts Hybrid Stability Technology. So I used to work for beauty, a beauty account last time. And a lot of their anti-aging products, they have Centella Aesthetica Extracts inside. So it's a type of plant. So I'm not going to be so boring about it. A lot of people say if you have sensitive skin, you should mix it with your uh, cream or lotion or whatever. So I'm not going to do that. The texture is not watery runny. It's still quite, you know, quite still. Yep, I'm just going to round it up. It smells a bit medicine-y. Okay, I'm just going to put it around everywhere. Okay, so far it didn't give me any sting at all. Moving on to step number 7 is sheet masks. And I have so many, so many different types of sheet masks. But my current favourite sheet masks are the ones that I got from Japan. It's not a Korean product, but to me, sheet masks, they all kind of do the same thing. My favourite sheet masks, they are from Japan. And I think you can only get it from Japan. They are the Lulu Lun Facial Sheet Mask. There's actually 42 sheet masks in this. The blue colour one is for moisture. This one I think is for whitening. Basis, it comes comes in this kind of form, like you don't need to waste earth with so much plastic so you can just tear it open and here comes one sheet mask out. It's somewhat like a makeup removal wipes. Ah, I just love it so much and it's so moisturizing. This whole thing is heavy and there's so much water inside here. Japanese or Asian products, they really fit it to our Asian face. A lot of European products like their sheet masks that don't fit our face. 
and I'm going to put it for 15 to 20 minutes. You see what I mean where it literally just fits your face like a glove? It's just so good. Okay lovely, so it has been 15 minutes. I always know that when I do face masks, it just makes my skin so nice and soft. Moving on to step 8 is eye cream, which is what I've been lacking of doing for the past 10 years. Many people rave about this. It is the Lanique Water Bang Eye Gel EX. EX stands for expensive. Because this wasn't cheap. Thank god it has a spatula because I'm not the type who likes to like dig my hands in it. Okay. Oh wow. Oh, it smells really nice. So I'm just gonna take this pea size up there. So time to tap it on my eyes. It's a bit gel like. Like I'm really rough when it comes to removing my eye makeup. And I rub my eyes like literally every single day. Maybe like, I don't know, five times. So that's why there's a lot of like stretches mark skin on my eyes. Oh my god, can you see those fine lines? And I do that all the time because I squint and like look at the computer. I see people doing this, but, like playing piano on your face. Oh my god, can you imagine like doing this every single day? Step 9 is moisturize. So now since it's kind of like the night time is not here nor there, it's kind of like the evening time and I'm not going anywhere because I have no friends and I stay at home all the time. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and use my water sleeping mask from Lightning as well. This this product has a lot of rays on it. I mean, look at the packaging. It's just so beautiful. I love it. It just looks so calming and nice. And it's like in a matte kind of frosty glass. It just looks expensive. Nighttime moisturizers are way more different than the morning moisturizers. The morning ones, they are more light. This is what I use in the morning and it's almost finishing. I got this from Japan as well. This has stick with me since the Japan trip. Oh, wow. Wow, look at that. The product is just up until to the brim man, it is so full. It comes with a small spatula as well. Wow! I feel like I just dive into an ocean. I feel like I can swim, even though I can't swim, but this product just makes me feel like I can. Okay, the product is not heavy or anything, but I do feel like it's there. And which is good because you're gonna sleep at night anyway, you're not gonna go out or anything, you won't feel like there's some stickiness on your face. So step number 10, we're finally here guys! This last step, you only use it in the daytime. Sunscreen, you need to protect your face from the sun because sun damages your skin and then that causes wrinkles and spots pigmentation. And tomorrow, I'll be doing the morning routine and I'll repeat everything and put on this the last. I'll see you tomorrow. I never tried out this brand before, it is from Biore. It is the Aqua Rich Water Essence UV that seems to be selling out a lot. The reason why I don't like sunscreen is because they have that terrible sunscreen smell and I'm hoping that this doesn't smell that bad. It, it doesn't smell that bad. <laughs> Thankfully, no, it doesn't smell like the typical sunscreen smell as well. So that was the last step for my morning routine and I'm going to continue showing you guys how my journey through this 10 step skincare, Korean skincare routine is like. Please hang up and try again. Hey girlfriend, what is up? So it's been two weeks since I done my 10 step Korean routine skincare. Current skincare routine and this is how my skin looks like. I know I have makeup now but here's some pictures without and here's a process of how it looks like without makeup. For me, the first thing that I was afraid of is the hassle of doing all these steps all the time. Like, oh my god, there's so much things to do. Like, if you can see day one's photo and today's photo, in comparison, it is a huge difference. The whole routine kind of helped glow my skin up. Like, I have pretty dull skin and my skin is not so happening. So, after I did that routine, I did feel like I got a bit more fairer and my skin tone definitely got more even. However, I do suffer from acne scars, so I am going to try invest in that like you can see I do have some red spots here and there but girl I gotta help a girlfriend so comment down below if you know how to get rid of all these red spots it's kind of annoying me and of course like I said a thousand times being a girl ain't cheap so if you have a low budget out of this 10 steps current routine blah, 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 I'm gonna be picking three items that I think might suit you 
and your budget so number one is definitely this toner that i've been crave craving no that i've been raving about and every time when i do this on my first step after washing my face i feel so relaxed and it just really calms me down and i really appreciate the sense of this and the formula is not so um oily and it's not so watery you feel like there's nothing going on you have to get this one girl this one is lanique water slipping mask and a lot of people have been raving about this and uh, now i finally know why this thing really helps me when you wake up in the morning the next day oh my god but it makes your skin really soft and hydrated and bouncy you feel like all those late nights and all those endless job amount of work you know it doesn't matter because you wake up feeling and looking f***ing great i'll definitely be trying to continue this 10 steps current makeup since i already spent all my money on it so might as well continue right i hope you guys enjoyed this video and also don't forget to follow me on my social medias bam 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 actually it's just instagram so i'm always there <laughs> so anyways i hope you guys have a nice day it is my birthday month i can't wait so yeah i'll see you guys real soon bye